A thief has taken a trailer from Jefferson High School in Tampa. Now, the theft comes at a really bad time for the school's band program as they're trying to regrow the program. The trailer is used to transport equipment and instruments to competitions at away games. Eight on your side, Jeff Patterson joins us now live at Jefferson High School. And this is a bummer. It really is. I mean, who steals from high school students? Good evening, Josh. That trailer was stored behind the high school here. And in the hours after a really big performance, thieves cut through two gates to make it to a big piece of the band program. The security camera video isn't the best. The camera is pointed toward the door and not the trailer stored in the parking lot. But in the corner of the video, you can see headlights show up and someone drive away with the band trailer. Band and orchestra director Alex Pedigo had just finished up the last concert and award ceremony of the year the day before it was stolen. And then I came to work on the next day um, and I saw the gate was open and I walked and I was like, okay, the trailer is missing. At first, he was shocked. Then reality set in. They discovered someone used bolt cutters to get through two locked gates in order to steal the trailer. The trailer is used to getting us uh, to our performance assessments, competitions, away games. Um, we put our instruments in there. The trailer and its contents are valued between six to ten thousand dollars. Students in the program were shocked when they learned what happened. That's kind of like low low. If you're gonna steal from, you know, 14, 15, 16 year olds because it's a trailer. The theft hits their small program very hard when funds are tight and fundraising isn't easy. So we did a popcorn fundraiser. Um, we raised $3,500, but we really only profited $1,500 from it because of it. So for us to do that throughout the year, we would have to fundraise every week. Obviously, if you have information about this stolen trailer, the Tampa Police Department would like to hear from you. Josh. Obviously, the, Jeff, the trailer is very important to them, you can tell. So what are they going to try to do without the trailer? Well, some of their instruments, particularly the percussion instruments, are just too large to fit on the school buses that transport the students. So they're going to have to rent a truck or something in order to get those instruments and their other equipment to their band performances and to some of the competitions that they hope to compete in. Yeah, you hate to see this stuff. Unreal. Jeff Patterson, live for us in Tampa. Thanks, Jeff, for the update.